If you can just take for a moment and imagine you're a six-year-old, an eight-year-old boy or girl, and you've been abused by a family member, which generally is the case. Imagine the courage it takes to share that. It's sitting in the room with a child and giving them the space to talk about possibly the worst, darkest thing that's ever happened to them. They're real kids with real futures. They have their friends, they have their life. And understanding, you know, we really need to make sure this kid's safe so those things can continue and this kid can live the life that they deserve. It's tremendously courageous. And their worst fear is they're at fault. I know that when children come here, they're going to start on their journey of healing. They're going to be heard. They're going to be valued and they're going to be safe. Um, their stories stay with us. That's partly why we exist, is because it's our responsibility to walk along with the child and help carry the burden of that story. We as adults have to be the voice of children, because if we're not the voice for our children, I just simply want to ask who will be.